today I'm going to be making an obstacle for my training area. Um, it's commonly called a cowboy curtain. I'm going to be using a frame from a section of chain link fence. It was old and raggedy and um, my husband just cut the chain link out. We rigged the frame up so it wouldn't fall over. To make the curtain part, I'm gonna be using outdoor fabric. These are just some scraps I had left over from when I used to raise sheep and I made little sheep coats for them to protect the fleece. You can use ribbons, yarns, any kind of strips of fabric to make your cowboy curtain. So I'm gonna to get to it and show you guys how I've got this frame set up and, you, and so many things can be a frame. Okay, so this is the frame from the um, the chain link fence. There's an intact <laughs> chain link frame there. And we've used that to stabilize the frame we cut out. Now anything can be used as a frame, but this is what I'm using because it's what I had laying around. And the whole idea be behind DIY obstacles is to use things that you have laying around. Right, Dylan? going to cut strips of fabric and tie them at the top of the frame. Doesn't matter how wide or how thin, how uniform. The strips I'm making are likely going to be really raggedy because I am not a perfectionist when it comes to things like this. I've got my strips of fabric hung up here, tied up, and yeah, it looks pretty raggedy, but that's okay. It's going to get the job done. But I also put a pool noodle up. This can give a little different feel when the donkey hits up against it. Take my fingertips and I just make a little hole. It just makes the tiniest, tiniest hole and it'll close back up. The foam will close back up around it. String it through. And you can just leave the twine hanging there too. I look forward to seeing who will just go through it because they trust me enough to go through it and who I'll have to work with to go through it. It's a great, cheap obstacle. You can make, just get creative. 